Well, there are over 20 million micro businesses in the United States. According to a recent study by GoDaddy's Venture Forward Research Initiative, about half of them are run by solopreneurs and around 94% have 10 or fewer employees, but their impact is bigger than you think. Joining us now to help shine a light on micro businesses, their impact on local economies, and the work GoDaddy is doing to empower entrepreneurs across the country is Alexandra Rosen, Senior Director of Venture Forward at GoDaddy. Good morning. Good morning, Jason, how are you? I'm wonderful. Glad to see your face here on our show. You know, micro businesses are small, but they are mighty. Why is it so important to recognize them and also their positive impact on local economies? Yes. So you said it perfectly. They are small. 94% have less than 10 employees. Over half are solopreneurs or no employees, but they affect the economy and their local communities in really big ways. They drive up household incomes, they lower unemployment, they create wage jobs, and they just make the economies way more resilient, which we saw during COVID. They're very resourceful, that, 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 that is so true. The mission, Alexandra, of the GoDaddy Venture Forward initiative, tell us about that. Yes. So GoDaddy began Venture Forward in 2018 because we wanted to uncover the impact of these small but mighty micro businesses, looking at over 20 million of them across the U.S. Now, fun fact, and I'm a Miami resident, moved during the pandemic. So big hey, welcome. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. I love it here. Um, and you know, one of the things that drew me was the bustling community of micro businesses in Miami, because there are over 800,000 in the Miami Metro. And during uh, 2020, Miami ranked number one of all cities, major cities, in terms of concentration of micro businesses, meaning how many there were per every 100 people, it was in the double digits. So with that said, that's those one, those are really staggering and positive numbers. We'd love to hear that about our community here in Miami. But with that said, though, you, know, you guys did a recent study on the impact of micro businesses, but that concentration of micro businesses in our community, what did you guys uncover? Yeah, so we learned that they affect, as mentioned, incomes rising, lowering unemployment, staying more resilient during this time. And 2.8 more million micro businesses were created in 2020 than in 2019 nationally. And about a third have been created since COVID. And who is creating them has changed. So for example, what we're seeing is women owned micro businesses have grown to becoming more than half of the new starts. Um, and in terms of why people are doing it for income, who they're serving, we're learning a lot about the motivations and the impact and the fact that it's a real source of income for many, whether main or supplemental. And, and also, we should do our part as community, as, parts, as citizens in our community of helping these micro businesses stay afloat, patronizing them, showing up for them, um, you know, investing in them as well. It, it's a beautiful thing. Where can we go for more information on the GoDaddy Venture Forward Initiative? Yes, so all of our information, um, including if you had a map of Miami with concentrations, all of our resource, um, all of our survey results available at godaddy.com slash venture forward, where you'll also find information about GoDaddy Open, which is a new initiative we just launched to partner with cities to share this information and help them make, help them empower these entrepreneurs and make more resources available to these micro business owners. So wonderful to see Alexander Rosen, Senior Director of Venture Forward at GoDaddy. Thank you. And again, welcome to Miami. Thank you.